This week's tip at Computer World is how to set up Family Share on all your Apple devices. To set up Family Share on your Apple computer, you'll want to go into your system preferences. If you are on your iPad or iPhone, make sure to go into settings and down to iCloud. Within system preferences, you'll also select iCloud. And right within there on the computer on the left hand side, you'll see under account details, set up family if you have not set it up already. And on your iPad, you will see it over on the right hand side. So what you'll do is select set up family. The next window will give you an explanation on what family sharing is. So it's an easy way to share what's important with your family members like your music, movies, apps, and books. You can also share photos and videos in a special family photo album. You can schedule events on a certain family calendar. And then you can also see the location of your family members devices. Uh, family share is available for up to five family members. And the nice thing is, is that you can have a specific Apple ID now for your child who is under the age of 13. So what I'm going to do is click continue. If you do want to see more details about it, go ahead and click the details button to go to another window. But when I click continue, the main or organizer is going to be a parent. Uh, so that will be you who is setting up the family share. So you want to make sure again that it's a parent who has access to a credit card. You're going to be using the credit card to be purchasing anything through the App Store, which will then be able to be shared onto your family's devices. So then again, I'm going to click continue. And now it says that any purchases made from the Apple ID that you have will be shared with your family. Um, it does give you an option to use a different account if you want to use a different one at that time. Otherwise, you're going to click continue. And now it says that I can add a family member. So when I click add, you will, um, on the computer, it opens up iTunes. So then you will have to enter in your Apple ID and password just to make sure that all the billing information is correct. You will want to make sure that you do set up a payment card, whether that's Visa card, MasterCard, American Express, or Discover, uh, and you can use your PayPal account. Now you'll be able to go through and add any family member that you want using an email address. That email address is going to be the one that they use as their Apple ID, or you can use it to set up a Apple ID account using that. And again, your children under the age of 13 now can have their own Apple ID. The reason why you want each person to have their own Apple ID for their device is because then you can limit what is being shared to each device. Currently, if you have one Apple ID account and both you and your husband are using it, there is the chance that you could delete some information from your phone not knowing that it's yours and it is your husband's. We have seen that in the past. So using the family sharing is definitely a big help and will limit anything being deleted by accident. And that is how to set up family share on your Apple devices. <laughs>